Okay folks, I'll have to do this one in full colour because otherwise it's going to look like a piece of shit. I have to use the cyan. I can't do all my demos today without cyan, however much I feel I have to because it's running really down. And I'm really, yeah, we're on its way, it's on its way out and it's out. I don't have any toner to replace it with. So, she's not going to make it gonna make it 400 I don't know gonna make it 400 Okay, let's see what we have to demo with. We have here a uh, sticker. Majamic. I don't know what that is. It's some kind of yoga thing, and I've seen these around on street light poles everywhere and shit. Not this type. This is the most elaborate one I've seen of Majamic. I don't know why it's called Majamic. He's a YouTuber. I do think he's the person behind this Majamic stuff is a YouTuber. He does, tries to make money off his YouTube channel. Which is really difficult. I don't do that, folks. I don't make money out of my YouTube. Um, and that's come up looking a treat already. We've got this nice shape. So we're just going to maybe just get straight into it. We're not going to get fussed. We're going to run low well on this colour. So... But I'm really missing a lost loved one. His name is Luigi. And I can't replace him with someone else. I'm interested in getting in touch with him. If I could. If I had the, um, the wherewithal to do it. So I'm trying to get my this work I do here. Into the 6 o'clock news. Onto the, onto a, um, on the free to air network. If really popular the um, mainstream uh, TV media so it's really proven to be extremely difficult to get them interested in my in my work and get them to feel sorry for me that I'm not with the one I love it really is sad but what can I do folks I'm powerless I don't have any say in anything folks has been basically the story of my life not feeling like I have any say or any rights as a person and I made mistakes when I was young I got bullied throughout my school life and most of my work life and basically that's that sort of got to my head uh, a little bit and stuffed me up contributed to me uh, stuffing up my life further um, got to believe in yourself folks even when the bullies are coming down hard on you you got to believe in yourself folks otherwise you'll never get anywhere you'll be end up like me you'll be end up decades behind and you'll end up yeah really miserable so you got to believe in yourself and believe in your talent believe in what you're good at what you'd be the best at don't believe the bullies, folks. Don't listen to them. Just fucking to give them the middle. Don't even, yeah, try to ignore that. No, that's not easy. Not when they're in your face. That's the hard bit. <laughs> because when you, if you respond, they, they love it. If you ignore them, they might still keep going. And then you end up bottling it up. And then all of a sudden, bang, you explode. And that gives them fun as well. So it's really hard to know whether it's what's the best. You, you can't win with these bitches. Uh, so yeah, I don't know. That's a good question. How do you ignore them when they're just constantly at you? Constantly, not just every now and then. I'm talking all the time that you're in a fucking classroom, all the time you're in the playground, all the time you're in the library, everywhere it happens. You can't avoid it, my experience. 
enough of that. This looks really quite interesting. I think we can now call it quits.